Y'all know I like bullets, right? Hey guys, what's up? JT here, and guess what? It's time for another 7 People You Meet video! Living in New York City, I haven't really been to too many clubs. I've been to a couple of bars here and there. I have compiled a list of the 7 People You Meet at a gay club. So number one is the hot go-go boy. Now these, most of the time, number one, is they're probably straight. That's a, that's a topic for a whole nother video. I love, I just love it when they put on some boots and like some cute little shorts and just get up there. Number two is the local drunk. Now this guy is in this bar the same three days a week, every time, never fails. The bartender knows him by name. He is the local drunk and everybody knows he's a drunk ass fool. Number three is the bachelorette party. Now, I don't know why girls be like, oh well, I'm getting married, so I'm gonna have my bachelorette party at a gay club with my gay friends. Yeah. Fuck you. Number four is the creep. Now this guy is like 60 years old and he wears khaki pants and dirty white tennis shoes and a white button down and he has hair like Donald Trump, and he's creeping on these 18 and 19 year old boys like a weirdo. Just sitting in the corner, like doing nothing, like being weird, it's mad weird, bruh. Like I see it, and it's weird. <laughs> Number five, the gay lister. The A lister for gay, she's like the celebrity of the gay bar. Everybody knows him, maybe he like he knows someone that owns the club, but he doesn't really like own the club himself. Hey girl. Yeah, he's, well, he's that guy, and you'll know him when you see him because he's probably wearing like some t black leather pants with some white Air Force Ones, a tight white shirt to show his, like, his little muscles or something, and then a hat that looks just like this one, but instead he's just cocked to the side like this. Exactly. Number six is the straight female best friend. So. I'm guilty of this one. When well, you are a gay boy and you want to go to the bar, so let me call up my straight female friend that likes to go to the gay bar too. Yeah, there will always be at least one fag hag in the bar. Number seven is the awkward straight guy. Now, I have put one of my best friends in this position many of times, many occasions, and made him the awkward straight guy. Now, he's very secure as my splendid. He knows he likes pussy, he loves pussy, he never gonna leave, he don't like dick, he just knows he doesn't. And I go to the straight club with him, so why can't he come to the gay club with me? No problem, we have a good time, and we get drunk, and we go home and crash, and then we get up the next morning and watch cartoons, like look kids. Whatever. Now, this awkward straight guy most of the time is like drinking Bud Light and wearing a jersey and everybody else is drinking vodka crayons and dressed like a queen. Now, of course, I couldn't include everybody in the list, so here are a couple of honorable mentions. Oh, oh my god. The PDA couple is so annoying. They're like literally like all over each other. They're basically doing everything except for sucking each other off. And if you go to the right gay club, you might find them doing that too. And then don't forget the PDA non-couple. Yeah, the ones that just met that are doing everything under the sun except for basically sucking each other off. But if you go to the right gay club, you might find them doing that too. If you guys liked this video and made you laugh, then give it a big thumbs up. And please go ahead and click the share button and share it wherever you want. Throw me all over the internet. I love it. Did I forget anybody off my list? If I did, then tell me down in the comments below. And you can also tell me on social media. That's Instagram, Snapchat, and Twitter at jcadence. Or you can follow me on my Facebook fan page, Jordan JT Tranberg. If you guys want to see other cool stuff, like some more 7 People You Meet videos, then click on the I on the top of the screen. And if you guys have not subscribed to me, then you can do that. And you can also check out my most recent video by clicking on the blue screen. I thank you, and I love you guys. And remember, a thumbs up means you like me, and a subscribe means you love me. And I love you too. And I'll see you guys next time. Do -do 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 -do.